Hey lovelies, welcome back to Gladys Cooks. In today's video, we are going to be frying some fish, that being a red snapper and some tilapia. As you can see right here, I'm getting ready to clean it. So yeah, if you don't know how to clean your fish, here you go, watch me um, as I clean the fish and let's all learn together, okay? Make sure the scissor you use for your fish is very sharp. You don't want to use a dull scissor or a dull knife to clean your fish, okay guys? Alrighty, so yeah, sit back, watch me do my thing. I hope you learn one or two from this and yeah, so yeah, if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, I am pleading with you, please subscribe to Gladys Cooks. Let's learn, let's learn together, let's cook together. And um, to my old subscribers, I say thank you for staying with me, thank you for subscribing. Um, and to my new subscribers, I say a very warm welcome to you. So yeah guys, how have you all been doing um, with this um, Corona thing? They said we should get the vaccine. Have you all been vaccinated? Yeah, so um, yeah, I think my uh, my scissor is getting dull on me. I, it's about time I get a new one anyway. So yeah, I'll probably get a new one very soon for my next fish fry. Okay, so yeah, here yeah, I'm done. Um, I try to soak my fish in a little bit of vinegar water. Um, so here you guys see me um, putting some water onto the fish. I already have the vinegar in there that I didn't capture. And this black stuff you're seeing there is always in the tilapia when you buy them. So make sure you really put your fingers in there and scrub it. And trust me, it will all come off, okay? Don't fry your tilapia looking like that. That doesn't really look good at all. Okay, so yeah, here you go. See how nice it is now. And yeah, here we are going to cut the fish. I cut mine into two. I don't like them really small. And then I put a slit in, be in between. You see that? Okay. So yeah, you can. That is uh, very nice when you're done frying your fish. It's very good for presentation too. Okay. And here's my whole tilapia. I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to cut it and put a slit into it. This one was a very big one, so I had to cut it in three parts, okay? Okay guys, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And yeah, the almighty fish head. Okay guys, so I am done cutting all of the fish. Um, right now I'm gonna get ready to season them. And as you can, as you all know, you can use the um, season of your choice, okay guys? Use whatever season you prefer on your fish. As I am doing, I'm using whatever I prefer, and I'm showing them to you if you like to pick one or two from it, okay guys? Okay. If you haven't yet subscribed yet, guys, take a minute to subscribe to Gladys Cooks and follow me on all social media platforms. And guys, for my salt, I like to use the pink salt. It is very, very healthy. I recommend that if you haven't started using pink salt yet, it's all over in the grocery stores. Try to look for the pink salt and use it. It's a very good, heart healthy salt. Okay, guys? And here I am tossing all my fish so that everything is nicely coated with the seasoning. And here I have my flour in my tray. Also, I like to season my flour before... Um, dipping the fish in it it gives it a very nice taste of the fry okay and here also i'm putting the seasoning of my choice in there so yeah you can put whatever seasoning you want into your food no need to hassle for anybody's seasoning if you don't have it use whatever you have okay guys and once i am done i am gonna stir everything mix everything together pardon me i said stir but it's actually mixed i'm gonna mix everything together and then I will start coating my fish and as I am doing this I already have my oil on the stove heating up so that way once I am done coating it I will just drop it in the oil okay so yeah so right about now it's time to start frying so I am gonna concentrate on frying that way I don't burn myself so yeah here we go all the fish coated and I am gonna start dropping it 
into my oil. I like to put some um, herbs in my oil, but when I went to go look for some, I didn't have some, so I put some onions in the oil just to give it the oil a little bit of um, aroma and also a little bit of onion flavor. And I also put some bay leaves in there. You can use your rosemary if you have basil, you can put your basil. If you have garlic, you can put garlic in there just to get a little aroma in the oil. Okay. At this point, my um, my heat was on high, so right before I start putting the fish in my oil, I'm just going to make sure it's between medium high. I'm not going to leave it on high. I don't want to get my fish burnt. As you can see, I'm dropping my fish into the oils, and um, you have to fry this on both sides at least 15 minutes each on both sides, okay guys? or until um, it is crispy enough the way you want it okay for me um for instance i don't i do not want it too crispy because i'll be eating this with some bounce or comic you know how we the guys do it oh, Okay guys, this is just to make you laugh, okay? I hope I made your day. Alright, so yeah guys, don't forget to like my videos. Don't forget to check me out on um, Gladys Cooks. It's my name on the channel, okay guys? And please share, 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 share. Don't forget to share. Okay guys, if you have watched me until this point, I say God bless you. Thank you for sticking with me until this point. And guys, don't forget to subscribe. Drop me a comment in the comment section below. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to share this video to your friends. And also, it's time to come in and turn my fish. I am doing so right now. I do not want it to burn, so I keep checking on it every now and then. And I'm flipping them over because it's due for me to flip them over. Okay, and as you can see, it's all done. I am taking them out of my oil. And yeah, thank you all so much for watching. I love you all the love has been real, real. It's been truly a blessing with you all here. And yeah, this is my final fry and I am done. I'm getting ready to take them all out of the oil. Until I come your way with another video, keep loving one another. Stay safe over there, guys. And be loving, be kind, and have pure joy in your heart. There is nothing like having joy in your heart. Joy like a river in your soul. Have a blessed Thank day. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Bye, y'all.